and welcome back to Cattails. In the last episode, we got so close to catching the black rabbit. Okay, maybe not close to catching it, but we saw it. So it does exist. So I think in this episode, oh, oh, it's snowing. Oh no, winter's almost here. Um, do you like hunting? Yes, that's what we're doing in this episode. Do you like rewards? If you catch 14 prey, they'll give us a mouse, three task tokens, and we get to keep the, the prey. Alright, so we will do that. First things first, our inventory, we don't have much in there. I think I'm going to go give a gift to Mossy. And let's just see who all likes. Actually, Savannah, do you like these? Uh, no. I know you like dragonflies, but do you like fireflies? She does! Savannah seems to like the bugs. Alright, well, we might as well talk to a couple of people while we're here. No one lives forever besides Crampy. The secret is leeches, as it always is, Crampy. I don't like snow. It's cold and wet and gets everywhere. Crampy, I have to agree with you on that. Snow is nice to look at, but... Other than that, I don't like it. Do you think you'll be going to the Autumn Festival? It's tomorrow at the Sacred Temple. Yes, I am going. In fact, I think I'm going to... Winter's pretty dull, but the snow sure is pretty. I'm going to hurry up, go around, catch prey, and then I think when I come back, we'll do the Autumn Festival, unless we find that black rabbit. Hello, kitten. It's nice to see you today. You seem pretty strong, kitten. You ever joined up with the border skirmishes? They protect the wetland and what's rightly ours. I fight alongside them most days that I'm able to. Interesting. So yeah, I'm gonna run off up here, see what I can find for rabbits, hopefully complete that task, and when I come back, we'll be ready for the Autumn Festival. Huh. It seems like the leader of the mountain colonies out here. Hmm. You aren't a mountain domain cat. What do you want? My name is Leo. I'm the leader of the mountain domain. Interesting. At least he's not going to attack me for hunting in his territory. Unlike Runt here. Should we have- well, shall we get into a little bit of a scuffle? Oh. I don't think I'm going to be able to get- Ah! I'm not paying attention. There we go. I unfortunately don't think I'm going to be able to get the prey that we're supposed to be grabbing. I only found two. And I'm going to blame that on the cold and the snow. No rabbits either. That is also being blamed on the cold and the snow. But I'll keep looking. <gasps> There's a rabbit! Oh my god! I got it! Can I pick it up? Oh no, I don't think I can pick it up! Oh no! Oh, I got it! We finally found it! Alright. Let's rush on back to the sacred temple and put this rabbit down. We finally found black hair. Oh, I can't believe it. Thankfully it spawned in a really nice place that was easy to get it. We kind of stumbled into this battle, but there's only two people, so we might as well do this battle as well. Alright. That wasn't too bad. Uh, let's hop on over to the next one. Since they're right next to each other, and I'm not entirely sure if we're gonna make it to the sacred temple and back. It's already 9 p.m. Oop, hey! Oh boy, this one's gonna be difficult. I can't see! Oh, look at all those cats! Can I just grab that, please? And then the rest of you can all, like, go jump in the river or something? That would be nice. Oh, we got a couple friends here. It's not gonna be enough. Oh, it's not gonna be enough at all. Okay, let's head on back home. I think we, we've done enough, had enough fun for today. 
We should probably also use those up and I want to take over the prairie tile. So let's hop on over there, take that over and rush back to the, to the den. I don't even think we're going to make it. Thankfully, it's just the festival, so I don't think it matters too much if we wake up late. Anyways. Oh, one more. There we go. We'll take over that. In fact, let's also use that to speed along our process, progress. Missed it. That was a waste of time. Hello, Earl. All right, let's run on back to the, ah, to the, okay, we might actually make it. To the colony. That's the word. Nope, I can't get distracted by food. We did not finish off our task, but we got that bunny rabbit. And I think mm -hmm. that's all that matters. <laughs> Alright, let's mm -hmm. eat up this crow, save the game, mm -hmm. and curl up for some sleep. Mm -hmm. And tomorrow we can go to the autumn festival. Mm -hmm. Today is the autumn festival. I should head to the sacred temple and join in the fun. Yes, we should. I don't think the temple's going to be open, so I don't believe we'll be able to drop off that hair, but we'll bring it with us just in case. Also, do we have a task for today? Looking for brave adventurers to scout out the land near our colony. Visit 30 different map regions. Oh, that should be pretty simple, right? Let's see, how many... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9... Uh, it might take a little bit. But, if we just kind of rush around... Oop, let's get this dragonfly. I think this will be the last day. Oh. Okay, never mind. But I think this is going to be the last day for us to be able to get dragonflies then. But, let's try and rush around all these tiles and get this quest done real quick. Well, I accidentally came into the festival, so let's go around talking to everyone. Crampy seems to be up here with the mountain colony for some reason. Having fun is good for your health. Take it from me, I'm a doctor. Delta, you're a beautiful looking cat. The Autumn Festival is my favorite every year. There's something special about how the temple looks in the fall. We need to get to know you, because you are very pretty. Hello, Robin. Oh, that's Jag. I'm only sticking around for a little while, then I need to get back to my post at the Mountain Domain. All work and no play, but I was actually trying to talk to Robin. Have fun today. Aw, isn't she sweet? Arthur! Wow. Mark thee how the winds blow today. This joyous occasion shall be our last day before the snowfall. Yes, it will. In fact, I don't think so. It, it was snowing yesterday. But I guess... I guess he means before the real snowfall. Perhaps we should spend less time playing games and more time discussing... More time discussing the territorial power shift since we last gathered here. Um... <laughs> I don't really- that doesn't sound very fun for a festival. Hello? The blackberry bushes are starting to wither. That means there's not too much longer to gather golden seal for the winter. Unfortunately, but we did find a couple herbs. We found quite a lot of prey today. A lot more than yesterday. It's a little chilly today, but that won't, that won't stop me from having fun. Where's our colony? I think some of them are here. Are you having fun? Yes, Nil. The Oracle? Strange are the ways of the other colonies that gather here. Let's talk to the rest of our colony and then we'll get into some of the games. Autumn is a lovely time for a celebration. Not too hot and not too cold. Make sure you don't leave without a prize. There's plenty to win. And let's talk to Zavanna. I think that's the last cat we have to talk to. I like to trade with other cats who attend the festivities. There's lots of exotic stuff to be found. Alright, I think. Oh, hello, Lyris. How beautiful the temple looks this fall. Do you not agree? Absolutely. Let's, let's do some festival games. Welcome to the Autumn Festival. Would you like to play? Uh, well, first, let's see what's in the shop. Ooh, a blue jay. I haven't seen one of those. Maybe we should buy that. Power paw, always useful. Decorations, pretty but not the most useful. Oh, okay, we have to get this. 
absolutely. I know I said that the decorations weren't useful, and this isn't useful at all, but we need it. In the autumn, we have the pumpkin carving competition. We're just about to start round one of three if you'd like to join. Great, follow me to the festival arena. Alright, welcome to round one. Your challengers, er, your challengers are Pebble and Missy. Oh, I didn't realize who we were going up against. Is it too late to back out now? Oh, Pebble, this is my first time. You don't need to be afraid. Um, why are you even trying to win? Don't you know I'm the best at this game? Okay, maybe Pebble's afraid of Missy. <laughs> the goal is to end up with the most finished pumpkins. You'll have one minute to carve as many as you can. Each pumpkin requires three steps, and you have to press E with good timing. Don't mess it up. Be careful. If you carve a pumpkin incorrectly, you'll have to throw it out and start over with a new one. Okay, here we go. Alright, we just gotta get this timing down perfect. Uh-oh. Missy's already doing better than us. I need to be a lot quicker with my pumpkin carving skills. We got this. Rapid fire. Okay, not so rapid fire on that one. Oh, I didn't think I got that last one either. Why? I don't like it when they start off in the beginning of the bar. It makes things so much harder. Whew. Well, that's an interesting picture there. <laughs> and that's the end. Let's see how everyone did and hand out prizes. Grim, you've won three festival tokens. Thanks for playing. Hey! I think we beat everybody. That was fun. Let's do that again. Today we are up against Scout and Alyssa. You can't beat us. I'll make quick work of you. We're gonna go up against Alyssa. Ooh. All right. Let's go. And that's the end. I messed up on a couple of them, so I wonder how we did. Oh, we still got three tokens. All right. One more time. Uh, are we battling the same cats again? Scout and Alyssa. Oh, well, let's make this a complete repeat of the last round then and get our three coins. Oh, <laughs> that actually scared me. Looks like we're done, and we got three tokens. That was fun. All right, Coco, can we join again? It looks like we just finished our last round for today. Don't worry, there'll be more games at the next one. All right, I guess it's time now to see what we're gonna buy. First things first, yes, give me that. That leaves me with only four tokens, so not enough to get much of anything. I think I'll save the rest of my tokens for the next one. But let's try on this new skin. There we are, a nice little shadow. Now we actually look like my cat Grim. I like this, this is gonna be our new skin from now on. All right, well, that's the end of the festival. Yes, leave festival. We're gonna get back to our den, 9 p.m. and we still need to do 12 more. Uh, I don't know if we're gonna make it, but let me try and run out there and see if we can get the next 12. Oh, there's not a way out this way? Okay. Well, that was a little bit of a waste. Let's see if we can actually get 12 tiles done. And I don't think we're gonna make it. We finished the task, but we are not going to make it back to the colony in time, I don't believe. We have 15 minutes. Oh no! Ah, but look at that, it's winter now. That was a quick change. All right, I guess let's head on back into the colony. And, oh, that's right, it's winter. That means we can actually skate around on this little ice. Oh, 
this little pond here. Look how fast we go. Do we actually start spinning out? Oh, we're going to have some fun this winter. All right, well, we failed in the task. So what's our task? A spy? Ooh, bring me info on the other colonies. Scout two foreign colonies' towns today. Does that mean we have to go in or just kind of peek onto their tile? What's a better time to scout than at night? Maybe we'll just not sleep. I mean, we're a little bit hurt. But there's no real reason for us to sleep. And someone's trying to take over our mining tile. Alright, well, if we're going to go scout the colonies, we might as well bring some gifts for them. Alright, I figured we'll give them two golden seal and a mouse. And then we'll have to stop by the temple and drop off our black hair on the way home. I'm also going to bring some lavender, see if we can spread some lavender around somewhere. This tile here probably could be taken over. Mm, yeah. Alright, let's head on out. We have no reason to sleep. Oh, what? Oh my god! Salutations! I was hoping I might catch you as you left your den today. My name is Mulby. Mulby, you scared me. I, I, yeah, you scared me. <laughs> Some call me a contractor, others call me a wizard. I always preferred those in the second camp, you know what I mean? I'm in the business of fixing up and upgrading homes. You ever feel like your den is too small? You come and talk to me. There's all sorts of neat stuff I can do for your den. Believe me, I'm an expert. Anyways, I'm going to leave a bell in your den. You can use that to call me anytime, alright? Just say the word and Moby will be Just say the word and Moby will be there to work on your living space. You can also use the bell to manage any decorations you've collected. Just know that house upgrades don't come cheap. It's a lot of work, what with all the paperwork you gotta fill out and stuff. But don't worry, all of that is included in my prices. And if you go for an upgrade, I'll, it'll take some time for me to complete it. I may be a miracle worker, but even miracles take time. Again, if you need me, summon me with the bell in your den. Talk to you later. Um, good to know. You kind of messed up outside my den. Whew, that was terrifying. Whoa, there's a bush there. <laughs> That one was surprisingly easy. I'm a little bit afraid to see what the next one has in store for us. We're getting a good stash of money. We might, we might have to hop on to um, that little bell and see if we can do any upgrades. Look at that though. Slowly chipping away at all the area around us. Alright, we gotta make sure to hurry up and sneak into camp, but I want to get these battles done first. Okay, we only have two friends here. Oh, oh boy. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Ah! Use my thing! Oh, oh, we're so dead. Run! Ah, hey look! Blueberries. Okay. Whew. Let's just take all of those golden seals, shall we? Our poor little Grim needs to hone in his, um... His fighting skills. But that's not what we're supposed to be doing for today, so let's try and rush on over to the Mountain Cat territory and see if we can sneak on in there and get a little info on them to help us defeat them in the next battle. Alright, we're one tile over. Let's get some sneaking going. So far, everyone looks to be asleep. Oh no! Hey, watch where you're going. This isn't your colony. Yes, I know, Jag. We're, we are supposed to sneak on sneak on in here. Unfortunately, it did not work. But, fortunately, it doesn't matter. Looks like it still counts as scouting out the colony, so let's give them some presents. Oh, right. I had to take all the golden seal. Well, we'll give you a mouse to the mountain domain. 7.9. How about a berry? Eight and a half. Uh, snake lily? We'll try and find some stuff for the forest colony on the way over there. Ooh, he likes that. I think that completes our quest. Yep. 
So we might as well just go and find who is it? Um, Sarge, and give him some presents. He looks very mad. But uh, actually, no. We're gonna give you these winter berries, winter blueberries. There. This is a good gift. All right. Well, I'm glad to be of use. Um, I'm glad to help with my gifts. Now, unfortunately, there's no quick river, so let's hurry up and try and get... Oh, try and get to the... What do you call it? Why do I keep forgetting? The temple. So here we are. We have our black hair. Let's... Ooh. Let's give it to the stone. Strange runes appear upon the pillar. You read them. You have done well, but there remains one thing I lack. Seek the purple jewel in a place of healing and contemplation. Journey to the hollowed garden to restore balance to this pillar. Ooh, we have more to do? Hmm, the hollowed garden? I know right where that is. It's just north of the sacred temple. I'll meet you there. Okay. Hopefully, hopefully there's like food and healing herbs or something up that way. Because, yeah, we have, we have some problems with our health. And hunger. And why are these paw prints just for decorations or they're actually something special? Because it kind of looks like the Four Seasons a little bit. Anyways, north of the Hollowed Garden or at the Hollowed Garden? I guess this answers my question. Hmm, do you think the Arcade Pillar wants us to go down these stairs? Only one way to find out. Let's see if the purple gem is really here. Ooh, beneath the Hollowed Garden. What a strange underground chamber! Did you notice the door at the back of the room? Maybe we can open it somehow. I love how we have our little breath showing. Even down here. What do we have? Green is left of yellow. Okay. Purple has no neighbor to the right. Okay, well that makes purple. Ooh. Wait, where are we? I'm assuming we have to leave them here. So purple is in the right spot. Red neighbors yellow and blue. So red is next to yellow and blue, and green is left of yellow. So let's kind of start like this. All right, and red is next to yellow and blue. Which means, how did I, okay. If we put yellow there, blue there, and red there, Oops. Let's pick up that <laughs> lavender. All right, so red is now next to yellow and blue. Green is to the right of yellow. Let me read these again. Green is left of yellow. Ooh, okay. So green is supposed to be left of yellow. So let's put green there, yellow, no, 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 green has to go here then, green, yellow, red, and then blue. Alright, let me make sure I got this so far correct. Green is left of yellow, purple has no neighbor to the right, so purple we know is correct. Red neighbors yellow and blue. Okay. Yellow is directly to the right of red. Okay. So... Well, actually it says green is to the left of yellow, which does not necessarily mean that yellow has to be next to green. So if we put that one there, uh, grab blue back out. Oh! Oh, whatever you're doing, work. The door in the back just opened. Nice. What was our last clue then? Blue neighbors green. Indeed it does. Oh no. We're starving to death here. Okay, well the door opened. And hey, look, it's a purple gem. You found a jewel. You should take this to the arcane pillar in the temple ruins. Alright, let's get out there. Can I take the power pause too? <laughs> All right, here we are back at the sacred temple. Let's go up the stairs and down these stairs. 
Here we are. Well, we have the purple jewel. What would happen if we tried to put it in the arcane pillar? Go ahead, Grim. Well, it looks to be floating over to it. Incredible! The arcane pillar's power has been restored. Hmm, it doesn't seem to have brought the forest guardian back, but at least it's progress. Ooh, what's going on over there? What's happening? Do you see the other pillars? It's like they're all activated all of a sudden. This calls for more investigation. What do you say, Grim? Maybe together we can figure out a way to bring back the forest guardian. Let's take a look. Looks like all these are glowing now. Okay, we're gonna have to go catch some fish. I think we have a few fish. Uh, this must be ocean stuff from the looks of things. So I guess we are gonna go to the ocean. Ooh, bugs. Well, that's an annoying thing to try and find in the winter. Maybe we should get that bug power then. And berries? Oh. Did I just eat all the berries? I did. Because I was starving to death. And birds. Well, I think we have... We have, probably have three, but three doves and two crows. I don't know about blue jays and cardinals. Yeah, I think in between episodes, I'm gonna have to look at these and see what we're missing. See what we have in our thing. Pack them all up in our pockets and then head on over here and drop them off. Here we are, back at the colony. Uh, let's turn on our task and then curl up in bed for a little nap before the next episode. Because Grim is probably very tired after staying up all night. I think that's going to be all for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like if you did, subscribe for more, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye guys!